Desperate attempts to save a woman trapped in the wreck of a horrific crash have ended tragically on a notoriously dangerous stretch of road. Three other people were hurt when the bus and car smashed head-on in Piara waters. A time-critical operation to save a critically injured woman trapped inside this bus. A banjo couple were on their way to fuel up before a camping trip when out of nowhere witnesses say a Suzuki SUV swerved in front of them on Armadale Road. In a heartbeat. Didn't have time to brake, swerve and I mean it was a serious hard hit. I heard a huge uh, crunch, spun straight around and saw the back of the bus up in the air and landing back on the ground. The husband driving the bus managed to escape the wreckage. His leg bleeding, he called for others to help his wife. He was in good spirits, concerned about his wife, um, but he was in pretty good spirits, hadn't gone into shock. It took dozens of firefighters an hour to free the 51-year-old woman who was rushed to hospital, but her injuries were too severe and she died soon after arriving. The crash has renewed calls for the notoriously dangerous stretch of road to be upgraded. It's scary. I will take an alternative route to school, which takes me at least an extra eight to ten minutes, but I think well, I might survive the trip there and back. In the past five years, there have been more than 85 crashes between Wharton and Taylor Road here. At least four people have had to be hospitalised, 22 needed medical attention and 50 of the crashes involved properties also being damaged. There are works underway to make the stretch of Armadale Road into a dual carriageway, but they won't be complete until next year. Hannah Sinclair, Nine News.